What's good, YouTube? It's your girl Babe with another video. My hair is looking crazy, but today I'm finally getting this interlock out of my car. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about. The machine that's attached to my ignition is finally coming out. I'm so freaking happy, you guys, and I'm going to go pick my new car up from the dealership. If y'all seen that last vlog where I went and got my car, um, I didn't want to install that crap in my car because I only knew I had a week left for this program. So, yes, you guys, I'm so happy. I have a, a lot to do today, so I'm gonna deal with this and then I have uh, another appointment to go to, but your girl is super happy today. My hair is looking a mess, I don't know why, but anyway, you guys, I'm so happy to get this done today. This is Vlogmas Day 16. I am not gonna be on interlock restrictions anymore. Um, I'm just, Going through a, I've been a, going through a lot with this car, and I'm so happy so I can pick up a new car. So I will see you guys when I get my new car. Because your girl is super happy, and Friday is tomorrow, so definitely gonna be celebrating. But I ain't gonna be driving and drinking. So see you guys when I go pick up my car. It's removed. Nothing in my ignition. I'm so happy. I'm gonna go pick up a new car. That's the day I was waiting for. I have. This is the new car right here with the doors open and we're gonna go to the old car for the naysayers that said that our girl didn't get your core because I know y'all's ready to look. <laughs> One, two, three, bye Kirio. It was very, very long journey or whatever, but I gotta say bye to you. We had a lot of good times, a lot of freaky nights, a lot of chilling and drinking but i just don't want to be associated with you no more so i'm breaking up with you bye Rio. and those are damages for the car y'all yes beating my new bitch and we finna rock out tonight period all right i'm gonna see you guys so we now arrive to the little round we waiting for one more girl to come so that's what the night is giving, but the drinks are very expensive here. Everything is 15. I'm like, I ain't finna, uh, I am not gonna forfeit. Hold on, hold on. I'm not gonna forfeit all of my money at one time, so we're gonna wait. I'm trying to take a photo, and she's, girl, I'm trying to do a video. You trying to make me take a photo? Do you love my new bra? Don't my boobies look amazing? Oh, that's good. Girl, send that to me. That looks so good. Anyway, we're waiting for some people. So I'm going to see y'all in a little bit. It's like an hour later. We're waiting for my friend to get here. I'm not going to lie. It's boring. As you see, there's nobody here. So she better come on soon because there's other places to be at where it can be popping. Cause I am extremely bored right now. When I say extremely bored, I'm extremely bored. Ain't a damn thing going on. So hopefully she should be here soon. We still want it up, trust me, okay? Not 
It's your girl Z baby. How y'all doing? It's like four days later. I was supposed to record on Saturday, but honestly, I was tired after all the stuff I did. Oh my goodness, I'm having a fight with my seatbelt right now. But all the stuff that I did, I was just so exhausted. Like far as like um on Thursday, because I had to first get my car you know from the dealership then after i got my car from the dealership i had to go take my other car back you know what i mean and it was just like a lot to deal with and then i just you know, i'm trying to get used to this car wait a second uh, this car be moving fast oh boy what am i supposed to do oh here we go yeah, so I had to go to the dealership and, um, you know, go get my car. And then I also, this is annoying. Y'all, I got some soap that I bought and the thing is cracked. So basically, I had to go to the dealership and go pick up my car. Plus, I had to get the interlock system out of my car. And it was just a lot. And then I also um had went out with friends or whatever and now i'm going back to work which is saturday i'm so glad to be back to work even though my um manager called me and was asking me to come in at two they changed my schedule overnight and then she was like oh don't even worry about coming anymore or whatever and i'm just like okay so i'm like all right so i'm like you know what i'm just gonna come in my regular time because my regular time it's four o'clock it's not two o'clock like anyway i'm just like ma'am i will be on my way and right now i always tell y'all i told y'all this last year i'm looking for another source of income always looking i need a job like just get a business for real because working for people is annoying but i was like at this moment I'm just trying to pay off my debts and I'm almost done. Even though I bought um, a different car and everything, I'm almost done paying off my stuff. And I love my vehicle. Like, this is my Christmas gift to me and I'm glad that I got it. But um, other than that, like, I'm just on my way to go to work because that's what I got to do right now. Um, I just, I don't know. I feel like I'm stuck in a like a sunken place sometimes because I had so many jobs like Jesus Christ my W-2s are out the water but me personally like now that I'm starting to apply to stuff I'm like you know what look at this fool these niggas be jumping in the middle of the street and then they be wondering why they be getting hit so yeah but right now, you know, I did it the wrong way the last two years. I've been applying to stuff that's part-time. And I'm like, no longer am I going to be applying to anything that's part-time. Everything I apply for, it has to be full-time. Because you can't really survive off of part-time. Especially, like, if you're working. Like, the job that I work now, I don't even know if I'm full-time. But I just look at my schedule and I'm very disappointed. Like, I only have, like, I think two days for next week. And that's because of Christmas and i um requested that i don't work on thursdays and fridays so they have me off but saturday is blocked because the building is closed and you know i was just you know doing a prayer before i got on camera and i was just you know praying that i get something that's full time like and then i was disappointed because this lady told me about a full-time position i did my background check and then for some bs reason um they're not trying to accept the fact that I had DWI on my record, so I sent them a statement, and, like, she told me she would call me back, and then I called her, she told me to call her on, um, what was it, Monday, and she wasn't in the office, so then I called her on, um, I called her on Tuesday, because, you know, like, I want to know what's good, like, don't tell me about a job and now all of a sudden you know I don't hear anything from you I hate when people are fake like that so you know I called her back and she basically was like 
oh, I'll call you. And then I looked on Indeed because I was looking for a job or whatever. And they put that same job posting that I applied for and went to an interview with back on Indeed. And I was like, that's some BS. So that's why, you know, sometimes when you get something, you can't share it with people. And that's me. I'm an oversharer. Sometimes, like, I share too goddamn much. And I would, yet instead, if I would have kept my damn mouth closed about the job, telling people, I would have had it. That's why I said, you know what? When I get something else, like something different or whatever, and something else goes my way, I'm not going to announce it. Sometimes when you announce stuff early, it does not go your way. I look at a video like that. Like, it doesn't go your way when you're announcing stuff early and be like, oh, I'm going to get this and I'm going to get that. And then it doesn't happen. Like, the same thing for this car. Like, I've been said I was going to get this car, but I didn't, like, go tell a bunch of people. I just, like, wrote it down on what I was going to do and how I was going to get it. And it came true. And I was like, you know what? The next, I right now, my biggest thing is I want to have a full-time job. Like, I'm not making money on YouTube as yet or whatever. I know I will in the future. But for right now, I need a full-time job. Um, I do have a part-time job, but it's not enough. I need a full-time job. And the only thing that's saving me, I'm allowed to, like, make purchases like this is because I live with my mom. But, like, right now, you know, like, I want to be able to get my own place. So, I'm just, like, I need to get a full-time job. So, I just keep looking. I know I'm going to get something, though, because if you know me personally, I'm always finding a new job. And I'm always somewhere. As soon as another door closes, another door opens. And I... I hold myself to that policy all day long, all day, every day, like, hold myself to that policy, but I'm just on my way to work, I'm my stupid behind, I'm supposed to take this daggone stuff back to the store, this, um, stuff from Safeway, but I didn't even take it back, because now I'm on the road to get to the place, to the job, so I'm like, you know what, F it, I will just, um, I'll get it later, the time of here is wrong says this is 116 this is not 116 but yeah i'm just on my way to work you guys like the um y'all basically gonna see me like the day before me hanging out with my friend we had an awesome time but back to the business and back to the money and i'm trying to debate should i come into work on monday or whatever but um i'm really not sure because i work today and i work tomorrow and i really don't feel like working on mondays anymore i just want to relax and sleep I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to even worry. I'm just going to keep putting applications out. You know, that's all I could do. And it's Christmas week too. And I still haven't got, I still haven't got some people some gifts yet. I'm going to get them, but I'm just like, uh, the time, the energy. So we will see. So I will catch you guys like when I get off from work because matter of fact, let me just end the vlog because like, the time that I went out and everything. So, like, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm rambling all over the place. But, um, yes, I'm super happy I'm off the interlock. And I keep saying I owe y'all story time. I really do. I haven't done the story time yet. But it is what it is. Like, me personally, 2022, I have to boss up. That is, like, my, my goal to boss up and, like, really be bossed up. So, that's all I want to do, you know, and I'm, I can't, and then another thing, like, um, the last job that I had, which was at the airport, was only paying me, like, $13.50, and I couldn't keep doing $13.50, $13.50 is, like, below minimum wage, and I'm like, yo, if I take on another job, it gotta be paying at least between $15, $16, $18 an hour full-time, nobody can work for no damn $500 paycheck, like, that's not the move, like, I, I can't do that. Hold on, y'all. I'm getting the car. So I finally arrived to the job. I'm in the parking lot right now, in this little parking lot. It's kind of raining outside, kind of skeptical and going out. But I just wanted to say, as me looking at the footage, if you're out there and you want to get goals done, you need to write it down. And that's one thing I need to do. So when I get off from work later, I'm going to write my goals down on what I want to happen because writing your goals down is super important and it will come true if you write it down. And I'm up there preaching on my video and ain't even practicing what I'm preaching. I'm like, you know what? I need to write that down. So that's what I was gonna do. But I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Mm. My voice is getting a little hoarse. I'm gonna take a trip to like the store to get some like little snack to eat on before I go to work. But please like, comment, and subscribe and leave a comment down below. This is Vlogmas Day. 18 we almost there 
even though I was all over the place with it, but I'm just going to title this one 17 and 18. But I hope you guys enjoyed my video. And if you're new, get to know your girl and hit the subscribe button because we're going to be lit all the end of this year. And yeah, only thing I need to do is film this story time, but it's coming up this week. I promise you guys, I've been wanting to do it like I miss my story times on my channel. So anyway, guys, I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye.